Hello Sagittarius, this is Leonard with Lingonberry Tea Tarot and I'm doing your tarot reading for the month of December. So I have a few new oracle decks. I have the Witch's Oracle, the Butterfly Oracle, the Whispers of Love Oracle, and the Love Oracle, Lover's Oracle, along with just the regular old um, fairy, Oracle of the Fairies and, and Angels and Ancestors. So what it's telling me is that you are potentially going to start your twin flame journey, maybe. I'm not sure. Um, but as for things that are going on in your life, you need to have caution. You need to start writing things down and having more intention on what you're doing because you're starting to forget some things potentially. And the bell is sounding the alarms. The Book of Shadows is telling you to write things down. The Witch's Circle is telling you to create a safe space for yourself to rest and relax. Um, you can start taking some next steps right now in regards to this and possibly doing some hobbies over the holiday season or just starting it. Because you do have um, protection and that you will be coming together with your family. And it's going to be a good holiday season, apparently. Uh, hmm, yeah. Hobbies and tend to create, enjoy growth reap rewards. So whatever you're doing with your hobbies, it's going to... Um, be really grounding for you. It's going to potentially turn into something that's um, very well for you. So that is your oracles for the month of December. So let me see what pulls out with the Mystic Manga deck. So I've already pre-shuffled the cards, so let's see what pops out. You are trying to manifest something. You um, have wish fulfillment in your life right now. Wish fulfillment for a happy life and happy family with the Ten of Cups. And there is definitely a reignition of passion or somebody coming in who wants to give you love. And right now you have a lot of options. You will be celebrating over the holiday seasons. Or, um, you may be acting a little bit recklessly over the December with the full and opposition. So watch out for that. In your career, you might have some sort of balance right now. Um, possibly work-life balance in your life. Because you, uh, you've earned it. You've won some major battles in your life. And as I was saying, you are manifesting something. Um, yeah. Twin Flame Journey, Four of Wands, Hierophant. Yeah, a bunch of love, but... Um, it's going to send you into a mini hermit mode with the Four of Swords. But this person is definitely coming in wanting to build something with you. And you may be moving away from this depending on um, your situation or you're just moving over towards them after doing some contemplation and moving into more calmer waters. So let's clarify the, some of this with the Universal Celtic Tarot. Um, another new deck that I have. So let's do the Ten of Cups. Ooh, that's a lot. That's like 20 cards. I'll take the top three and put the rest back. All right. 
In career and finance, you may be having an offer which helps you get this Ten of Cups, um, which brings you into Empress mode. And it is a definite wish fulfillment with the star here. So why is the Page of Wands here? another 15 cards top three um yeah death is bringing about a new beginning in your life which is bringing in this page of wands who sees you as their queen of cups and it might be this king of cups because it's um topping your deck so uh, and the moon will be illuminating things to you. So why is the King of Cups here? Tell us about the King of Cups. Oh, that's a lot of cards and a lot of reverses. Okay. So the King of Cups is your emperor who has been watching you with the Seven of Swords and who is feeling very much wanting to give you some sort of offer. Um... because he's finally getting out of seeing things in a different way. He sees things very clearly with you. Um, he may have had a tower moment in his life or whoever this person is, it's just energy. And they may have suffered a small financial setback recently. So if you know anybody like that, they may be interested in you for some reason. So let's look at the Seven of Cups. Okay, so we had the Hermit pop out. Mm. With all these options that you're being presented with, you are really contemplating about it. As I said before that um, you were going into mini Hermit mode, now you're just going into Hermit mode because of it. Um, so why is the Three of Cups here? Okay, that one wanted to pop out. Uh, again, this is a very balanced... Um, you're feeling very balanced in your life right now with the Six of Coins, with the Six of Pentacles. And, yeah, it's causing you to um, celebrate a little bit. And think about decisions that you want to do in, in the future with the Two of Wands. So why is the fool here? Because you're really not wanting to make decisions. You're willing to uh, not budge from what you're doing in your life because you don't want to battle anything. Um, and you are 
kind of holding on to your nickels and dimes with the nine of pentacles in the reverse along with your feelings and you don't really want to resurrect old wounds that may be popping up so why is the six of pentacles here Because you wished for balance in your life, so now you have it. Um, it may also be a... Mm, pregnancy from a past relationship that you're dealing with. Um, so why is the Nine of Wands here? Because you're speaking your truth as the Queen of Swords. So whoever is approaching you is going to get an earful, possibly. <laughs> so why is the Magician here? Also, you could be setting some really clear boundaries, especially if you dealt with this person before. Um, lots of okay. okay yeah you're manifesting love into your life and Temperance is ending those battles that you have been fe um, dealing with, with your emotions and your feelings. And yeah, you're feeling more loving and kind. You have the wheel coming in. Somebody is coming in very quickly. And a five of swords, but you are holding on to your emotions. So... Any other advice for Sagittarius? There is a lot of reversals in this reading. Wow. You may be rejecting love. You may be rejecting um feeling that you are lovable right now but fate is coming in to bring in that um option again because somebody wants a high level of commitment it could be your twin flame with this lover's card right here and so yeah so that's your reading sagittarius i hope you liked it please like comment share and subscribe down below and I will see you again next time. Laters.